What's up? This is DJ Dan. I uh, kind of wanted to give everybody uh, an overview of what I've done for my new artist album. It's called Future Retro. And I've basically gone back um, through all of dance music. Um, it's my 20th year in the business. And I've gone back uh, through my collection and done some covers of some of my most favorite tracks of all time. Some in the freestyle era, some in the disco era, in the house era. A lot of these tracks had you know, a serious meaning to me in my life throughout my DJ career. And I thought it was a chance to sort of like, you know, tip of the hat to them and how they inspired me and to do my own interpretations of them. Excuse me, Mr. Operator. I gotta call my baby. You dig? We're sorry. Your call cannot be completed as well. Uh, it's interesting uh, how house music evolved, or how music evolved from the 80s to the 90s to present day. The 80s was all about taking everything you had at your access, your favorite music, and making a collage. Um, then when it started to hit the la later 80s, when everybody was sampling, you'd get, you know, they'd be sampling a James Brown record and everybody on the dance floor would recognize that sample and they'd go screaming to the dance floor because at the end of the day, everybody loves to hear a little bit of the familiar. It was a celebration of, uh, you know, I know this track, I love this track, let's go dance to it. And a lot of that was coming out of Chicago at that time. You know, you, that's where you got artists like Fast Eddie doing Yo-Yo Get Funky. And then you had tracks like Mars, Pump Up the Volume. It was a big crossover record in the 80s. And then when it started to go into the 90s, it became more evolved. People started really getting serious. They started making their drums a bit tougher. Um, you know, we started to get into techno, bass lines became a little bit more hardcore. Um, but it was also, again, a lot of sampling. Sampling has always been there. It's always going to be a part of it. And I think that's what's so cool about house music is that it is familiar, but it's also new. One of the reasons I wanted to do this album is sort of take the tracks that really inspired me and to not just sample them, but recreate them in my own interpretation as a celebration of 20 years in the business.